the greatest challenge in the world today is all about energy. And we need sustainable energy to be able to combat this challenge. Working on this, on this Zayed project for me has been a great learning experience. First of all, because of the energy pre-audit that we did, we undertook on Saturday as a team. And working through the school and trying to look at how we expend our energy, I realized that we waste a lot of energy, which if we serve, could actually serve our costs a lot. Our project is three stage. Stage one it will be to conduct an energy audit to provide a detailed energy efficiency recommendation to significantly cut down on current electric costs and formulate an energy management plan for future sustainability of our school. where our school will introduce and host an annual energy challenge in which we expect to draw participation from the neighboring high schools in the community. In the first year, we expect to draw the participation of around 10 schools and then hopefully in the subsequent years, we will involve schools from around the country working in partnership with the Ministry of Energy, the Ministry of Science and Technology and the Ministry of Education. One area that we are spending a lot is on our electricity, but with this proposal of future energy, we can save 1,100 US dollars, and this will enable us to serve and take care of more of our poor girls. To keep a girl in the girl center, it cost Kenya shilling 85,000. And so saving 1,100 US dollars per month, it means we are going to take care of 10 girls per year. And that is a very big, big saving and service to these poor girls. As you can see here at Stare Girls, a learning institution that is 10 kilometers from the capital city of Kenya, Nairobi. It is located on 55 acreage of land. And out of this, as you can see, 50% of this land is covered by upland Karura Forest and a water reservoir. We believe in preservation of ecosystem because we understand that ecosystem sustains life. In Sare, we believe in ecological conservation and we have an ecological strategy that every visitor must plant a tree just the way we are doing. Thank you.